That's the best score so far. All right, back to Finland. Jussi Korhonen. It's a lovely orange t-shirt he's sporting there. You know what? He kind of looks like Bob Bernquist when he skates. The front of there was exactly like Bob. There's the go. The heel flip Indy, not a problem there. Into the 360 burial. Into the 540. He nails it. He's got some combos going. 360 barrel to fakey. Into a gay twist. Front side tail slide. Oh, going for the backside kicky. Can't get the board back under 79 points. 67 points for UC. Check this out in slow mo. 360 barrels are not a problem for this guy. That's sweet as. Into the 540. This guy's got it dialed. Uh-oh, there's a mug for you. Matthias Ringstrom took a 10th place in Skateboard Vert at Summer X last year. This guy has uh, got many names. He's, he's known as the Flying Meatball in my house. <laughs> and uh, he's actually my landlord, so I'll take that back. He's, uh, he's a champ. He's got all the moves. He's recently come back from a hip injury, so it doesn't seem to be bothering him right now, though. Into the method out of Fakey. Oh, half stale fish into the gate twist. This guy has a humongous amount of maneuvers. Backside lip slide. Backside air into the 540. Not a problem for Matthias. What has he got now? Well, he's setting up for something. Blunt to fakey. Into the nose blunt. Oh, front side nose grind. Yeah, meatball. New data fakey. Oh! Half cab indie heel flip couldn't quite make it. And listening it at the buzzer, but a solid run for Matias. He's looking pretty stoked. Check out the replay. Those mute 540s, he actually never tries until it's contest time and he never ever bails them. Mute 540s, you can now call them meat 540s. Yeah, meat. Yeah, hey, that, that'll work. That'll work. You made it up though, not me. All right. He's the current leader. 84 points even for Matias Ringstrom. We got three runs out of this deal, so two to go. Matias on top, Terrence Bogdou in second place, Yusuf Coron in, in third. Well, how I got started in skateboarding, I used to ride BMX bike. I used to jump this hill, and I used to actually be pretty good on a bike, but my bike got stolen. And at the time, skateboarding got pretty big, so I just picked up a skateboard and uh, I figured I could carry it around and not have it stolen. My highlight of my career would probably be winning the first X Games. That uh, I, I think that was 99 X Games. Mixing it up a little on this line again. This is, this is another one of the athletes we're seeing change up their line. What? Oh, yeah! Just oh my goodness! You can see the fatigue setting in. Hang on, buddy! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Oh. Woo. Oh, I, think, I think he might have did it with that run, man. If he did, I'm going to be so psyched. Oh, man. What I think of the event so far, uh, I think that there's a lot of great talent out here in Europe, and uh, it's great that ESPN's given them a, a place to showcase their talent and bring it to the U.S. Europeans have not really had a lot of respect in the U.S. Like, they've, they've always been looked at as kind of like, you know, they, they have their own style, but now that skateboarding has gotten so big, um, a lot, a lot of Europeans have gotten a lot of respect over in America, and I'd say, uh, some of the best are from Europe. The craziest trick I've ever done was a uh, 720 McKenzie. I named it after uh, my daughter because uh, it's a very hard trick and no one's done it yet. It's a 724 to fakey and I, got, I actually got to start doing it more often myself. I would love to see the X Games go everywhere, all over the world. I think it's wonderful to hold an event in different locations, especially a city as beautiful as Barcelona. The advice I'd give the young riders is to not 
take it, not take it too serious, to have fun with it and learn from it. It's a learning experience and it's just a way of, of it's a form of expression. You can, you can skate the way you want to skate. You don't have to skate like others. You don't have to ride your bike like others. You can do your own thing and just to have fun with it and take it as far as you can. Welcome back to Barcelona for the European X Games Qualifier. Our skateboard's Burt Finals underway. Look at the crowd hanging out here to check out the action. And Yoki Olsen on top of the rolling. Had a phenomenal first run. Blasting, but only putting him in the ninth spot right here. Going to have to step it up. And he looks like he's about to step it up. With a huge tail grab. This guy's got some really good landings on his airs. That's why he can go so high. He's, oh, my dangerous tail grab into the backside 540 of Doom. <laughs> this guy's not messing around. Frontside 50-50. With a sweet India. Big body jar in the corner. And this guy's got his dog. Oh, the heel flip in, he's got this one. Oh, the Medolly slide, bringing it back. 85 come alive. <laughs> oh, 360 body jar. Yeah, sick ride. Yoki's skating retro. It's that ponytail. Right on. Look at that tail grab, no foot. That was beautiful. It was a huge backside 540. Look at that ponytail just floating in the wind. Helps you out. 87 points. Much improved. Now sitting on top of the food chain in first place. <laughs> Terrence Bogdu had a great first run. Rock solid wall to wall. Sitting in third trying to improve on it. With the half leg twist there. This guy is really not going to jump off on anything. You can tell. He's staying on. He's, uh, he's here for keeps. Fakey frontside grind. Nose grab out of Fakey. Setting up for something. Frontside gay twist. Once Whoa. again nails it. He's not going to bail, you can tell. This guy just doesn't have it in the brain. Maybe a little extra glue on the shoes. Something like that. He's probably cheating there. <laughs> now oh. that, that I guess you would call a backside Chrysler Indy grab into a frontside 540. And Terrence Bogdu moves up to second place with 84.67 points. Yusi currently in fourth. This guy, I don't, you know, I think he knows Bob. He must know Bob because there's just a Bob similarity there. I'm sorry. That was a heel flip indie into the 360 burl into a new 540. He's got that combo. Oh, into a body burial 540. Into a veril in the corner. This guy's the combo kid, they call him. Stalefish. Mute to fakey. Heel flip indie gay twist. This guy is ripping straight into a, the most dangerous backside nose gone I've ever seen, followed by some kind of lip slide nose gone that didn't work. 82 points, currently sitting in that fourth spot, but one run to improve on it. Here we go. Back with Matthias Ringstrom. The meatball. The Swedish meatball, they call him. <laughs> well, actually, they don't. Just I Just do. you. Yeah. <laughs> into the big method air. Into the nose bone starfish. Matthias picking it up a bit. Japan air. 360 for early. Loves that move. Oh, going for the front foot impossible. That's his trademark, and he blew it. Loses the board. Needs to leash that thing. 360 for early. It's not a problem for the uh, meatball. And Matias sitting in the third spot. His 84 points from run number one. Going to stick right now. Ideal Diani. One of, currently sitting in fifth place. He's a good friend of mine, old Adil. He is one of those people who has no problem in going ridiculously high, as I'm sure he's about to demonstrate. He's got a good back to air technique, setting up good there. Into a huge Indy 540. Boning it out. What's he got next? Kick for Binny. Oh, he couldn't get it to flip. He's hiking back up there. Go, Adil. Get it. <laughs> What's he got? Thank you, tail sit. Front side 50 50. Back there, setting up in the corner. Kick for Binny, and he gets this one. Not a problem. A little 50 50 up on the lip. Oh, Indy 360. Got some moves, old Adil. What are we looking at now? He's going to hit the lip, I think. The back side lip slide. Couldn't quite hang on to it. What happens at the buzzer? See what the judges do for him. Take a look at the replay right here. Beautiful kick for Bindi by Adil. He doesn't usually have the street skills, but he looked like he did then. And that Indy 540, sweet as a nut, boning it out. 
76.33 from run number one. Going to stick for ADL. He's sitting in the fifth spot with one run to improve on it. Yoki Olsen sitting in the top spot right now through run number two with 87 points. Terrence Bogdu right behind him. And Matthias Ringstrom nipping at his heels. All right, we are back at Molde Marina. Run number three of our skateboard vert finals. A beautiful day on the beach and lots of action going on there. But our action, back to the vert. A deal, ready to do it. Run number three, his best score, 76.33 points. Ellis, mate, he's got to do better than that. He's got to do better than that, and I'm sure he's going to give it 100% to do so. With the front side bone air, prove it. Setting up with the back to there. Into the Indy 540. Another back to there. Kick with Bindi, boom, not a problem this time. Front side bone air. Another backside air. Backside lift slide across the whole ramp, looking sweet. What else he got going here? Setting up. Indy 360, oh! Oh, not in the grill. Kick with Bindi, making it look easy, and that slam making it look really bad. He doesn't really look any uglier, man. He's still the same old they do. And Terrence Bogdu taking it from the roll-in. Run number three. He's been flawless wall-to-wall -wall on his first two runs. Whoa, humongous method there in the corner. Into the... That's got to be his own uh, trick, I reckon. It's almost like a Superman variation. Yeah, well, yeah, let's just call it the Superman for now. Nose grab back to there. He's really good. Into the front side, 540. This guy is keen. He is just sticking to every move. He'll flip Bindi. I can tell you right now, he's not going to fall off. Oh, finger flip front side there. Into a viral Indy gay twist. This guy has got some moves, man. Look at that thing. The Superman Indy backside thing. Straight into the front side 540 of Doom. And I think you get a finger on the coping as well. And Terrence improving with every single run. 85.67 has him in second. Ah, uh, the finals was very hard because like there was three skaters skating very, very good, like you see and Jockey Olson. So it was very hard. I tried to do the best I could do, but I don't think it's enough. So we'll see. It's up to the judges. Oh, it might be up to the next two skaters. We'll see what happens. High on top of the roll, and we are about ready to go with Yoki Olsen currently sitting in first place. It's the power of the ponytail. Yep, let's see the flying ponytail go once again into the devastating back today. This guy's not messing around. Tail grab into the lean edge, just lofting around the ramp with backside tail grab. The backside 540 sticks it. Sweet as enough. Big stand up front side grind into the Madoli tail slide. D Way's trick. I'm sure Danny will be stoked to see someone doing that again. Into the half Whoa. mute and landing on the flat and still almost pulling it off. Look at this guy's ponytail and his 540. It is mind boggling. And Yaki currently sitting in first place with 87 points. Even got to be stoked. I think Jesse is going to be number one. Um, I don't know what score I got. So I haven't got a clue really, but yeah, we, we see what happens. They're going to shout it out pretty soon now. And we got one skater to go. You see, sitting in fourth position right now, knows he's going to have to pull out all the stops right here if he wants to get that last invitation to Summer X. I don't think he really has enough time to grow a ponytail either, so <laughs> he's really going to have to pick it up. It takes eight, nine months before that ponytail power kicks in. Yeah. <laughs> the backs are there. And the heel flip Bindi, he's definitely having a whack, that's for sure. 360 barrel into the mute 540. Into the backside 540. 50 50, what's he got? Front side air. Madonna in the corner. Little backside air, grabbing behind the foot. Kick flip into Fakey. Sweet, pulls it. Into the heel flip into Gator. This guy's ripping. This is definitely his best ride. Into a kicky to Fakey. Oh my goodness. You gotta be happy. He doesn't even need a ponytail. Look at that. Heel flip Indy Gator is not a problem. This guy's got some flip skills. Into a kick flip to Fakey, making it look like nothing. 
And the fancy footwork pays off. 89.67 points in that third run. Gives him the top spot. European X Games gold. And that last coveted invitation to Summer X. So Yusi takes the gold. Yoki earning silver. And Terrence Bogdu, the Frenchman, earns the bronze. Matias taking that fourth position. Pete King in that sixth spot. A deal sandwiched in there in the number five position. The medal's going around. Terrence pretty stoked right there. Had three great rides. Yoki, ponytail power. Get yourself one if you're a skater. And Don Fostick handed out the hardware to UC Corhonen, earning that European X Games gold in that last invitation to Summer X. There's a look at our winners. You got to get a little of that Scandinavian rock action in. A little air guitar. That's what you do, I guess, when you take that gold spot and a look at what got him there. UC Corhonen taking European X Games gold. Beautiful, baby. Plenty more action coming your way from the Virgin.